I'm here with Jemima. Mia, Hello. about an hour after her eviction. How are you feeling? Has it sunk in yet? Not really. I think it's. I don't even think it's going to sink in until I get outside. The yeah. fact that you're actually in there, because when you're in there, you don't even feel like you're in the house. And yeah. I just think it's only going to hit home when I go back into the outside world and back into my, you know, um, back normal to life. Yeah. yeah, normal, you know, see my daughter, can't wait to see my daughter and, mm -hmm. and mum and stuff. So it's just, yeah, it really hit home then, I think. Yeah. Well, we've just got a few questions from our Twitter followers. Uh, let's start with Shazza. <laughs> Shazza says, what is Sophie like? We've only seen her sleeping and eating. Sophie, yeah. oh my girl Sophie, she she was one of my closest girl mates in there, so I do get on well with younger people, mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> obviously. Um, Sophie loves doing hair and makeup, she did my hair and makeup tonight, mm -hmm. she's such a caring, lovely girl, she really is sweet, and I hope she doesn't get perceived or get shown just as someone sleeping and eating because there's so no. much more to Sophie. Well, I think the point is that she she hasn't been in any of the big arguments so far no, or any of the big tasks not, or anything. But she's so. got a good old argument on her. You wait mm. and see. As soon as it starts getting, you yeah. know, more, less people, more, you know, more nominations and everything else, you will see Sophie we'll go see off. More of her. She's such a strong character. She's such a great girl. Mm. I really like her. She's her and Hazel. I was closest to the most as the, as the girls. Yeah, um, Lorraine's army wants to know who is the hottest housemate, other than yourself, of course. <laughs> well, I don't think I was the hottest <laughs> one there anyway. Uh, Hazel, I've got to say. Yeah. You know, everyone fancied Hazel. I think I even fancied Hazel, <laughs> and I don't even swing that way, but Hazel is such a beautiful person inside and out, she mm -hmm. really is, and that's the only other girl I would really meet up with, yeah. really get on, got on so well with her, she really stuck by me, especially through, you know, the difficult times. So. Mm -hmm. What about the lads though, he was the hottest boy? Dan, definitely Dan yeah. is, is sexy. Sexy cop. Yeah, no, he is, he is. Even though we had our clashes, I got on so well mm -hmm. with Dan, I really did. Um, you know, just, we we had this sort of love-hate relationship, 100%. Yeah. Brandon wants to know, what was the best thing you cooked in the house? Everyone absolutely loved my bread. I've never done mm. bread in my life before, and, um, you know, I was doing all this garlic and parsley bread. Obviously, I've made garlic bread before, but not yeah. like that, actually from scratch. And that is one thing that I will be doing. You know, the first thing I'm going to do on Sunday morning is cook a loaf of, make a loaf of bread, take it round to my mum, and there make her a lovely off. big breakfast. <laughs> so that is one thing I'll be doing. Uh, they love the twins. Love my food. They were so appreciative, <laughs> and they're really going to miss miss yeah. my cooking. I really, you know, I think I probably was as strong as Jackie, even stronger than uh, a cook than Jackie. Sort of in the house, mm -hmm. really was. You know, and, and she was, she, you know, she's run sort of restaurants and stuff before, yeah. which I never have done. But I, I love doing the cooking and experimenting. And I'd wake up at three in the morning and think of new, a new thing to do. I am crashing this interview to say I absolutely adore you. And you oh, look absolutely you, amazing. Ronnie. And thank you for what you said in my housemate pack as well about me when you went in. Oh, yeah, good house. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> Sorry, Ian. Sorry, Ian. Get out. <laughs> <laughs> drop You're drop so yourself out. I love You're you. such a noble. Thank you, Ryan. Well done. Thank you, darling. <laughs> Unbelievable. Right, let's crack on. <laughs> He's great, isn't he? He really is. I'm so, you know. I love you, Jemima. You know what? I really take my hat off to you. You've done so well. You took my hat off. I love you. You really have. Just don't take your pants off for me. I'll see you Sunday. <laughs> Bye, darling. Right, if we if He's we done so well. are allowed to continue after being interrupted by X Factor rejects. Uh, oh, show me, he's done so well, <laughs> bloody really Ella nice. wants to know, uh, who would you have nominated if it was face to face? Would it have changed? Callum. Callum. 100% Callum. Callum, you know, when the task came up today and they were saying sort of, who do you like the least? Uh, no, who do you think likes you the least? I was going to press and say Callum. And then he came back with, um, uh, you know, he came back with his actually. Mm. I thought, I knew he didn't like me because he always used to, as soon as I started uh, talking about something, I could just say one line, he would jump straight in yeah. and sort of be overprotective of whatever I was talking about and not even listen to what I said. Um, and yeah, I definitely would, would nominate 
Callum, 100%. I think he's just, he's, you know, he he is as probably or even more flirtatious than me. Mm. Um, and I think he's just really taking, you know, he's, he's, trying to lead Charlie on, you know, not lead Charlie on, but he's taking, adva you know, advantage of Charlie yeah. because she's a very, very innocent girl and he really is taking advantage of her well. in the house. He really is. And if she gave him the go-ahead, he would definitely go for it. But I know that she's not going to do that. No, it's no. Not, that's not going to happen. Yeah. Um, one last question. Will you come back this weekend and give us much, many more exclusives for channel5.com slash bigbrother? Absolutely, yeah. of course. We've got a new friend. <laughs> Thank you very much, Jemima. Thank you.